Single board computers and USB powered displays go hand in hand, but many require more power than an SBC can provide on one port. That's where this comes in, the 10.1 inch display by DF Robot. Hey everyone, it's Project SPC and today I'm reviewing this display from DF Robot. A big thanks to them for providing this for review and incorporation into a future project. We'll go over the specs, what's in the box, and of course we'll try it out with some different devices to see how it works. For specs we have 10.1 inch IPS display, 800 by 1280 resolution, 500 milliamp power draw, mini HDMI input, and micro USB for power. In the box you get the display, a mini HDMI to micro HDMI cable, great for the Raspberry Pi 4. You get a full size HDMI to mini HDMI cable. And you also get a micro USB charging cable. Taking a look at the back of the device, we have some mounting holes here. And it looks like there are some speaker grills here. There are no speakers built into this, unfortunately. These uh, grills here are probably from a different product that they reused the case on this design. And on the side here, we have the micro USB and the mini HDMI inputs. This is by default a portrait display, so when you do plug it in, you are going to have to switch it to landscape mode. But seriously, the best feature about this is it only takes 500 milliamps of power to run. So as long as you've got a good power supply, any of these single board computers can power it off one USB port. Like the Raspberry Pi, or the Latte Panda Alpha, or the Rock Pi X. And let's take a look at the inside and see what the display looks like. As you can see here, the ribbon cable to the control board is quite long, so you could use this in an integrated project like a single board computer powered laptop design. You can pick this up at DF Robot for $69. Or on Amazon for $74. So in summary, what do I think of this screen? I think it is a great companion for a single board computer, provided you have the right one. So the Latte Panda Delta and the Latte Panda V1 are not compatible with this screen. It says so on the DF Robot front page. Um, I tested out the Latte Panda Delta and indeed it does not work. Latte Panda Alpha, Raspberry Pi 4, and Rock Pi X all work fine with this. I also tried my GPD Win Max. And I tried my desktop and it worked fine with both of them. So it's just a handful of single board computers that this does not work with. If you're in the market for a 10 inch screen, um, if you're looking for this on sale, Black Friday, this was $52, which I think is a steal for a 10 inch screen. I mean, if you're in the market for a 10 inch screen that's not touch screen, $70 isn't bad either. My previous 3D printer was not big enough to print an enclosure for this screen, but I've upgraded to the CR10 and this is capable, so I will start designing an enclosure for this. And I am going to be making a laptop out of this. So stay tuned for that. That's it for this video. If you enjoyed it, please hit the like button, maybe even subscribe, and thanks for watching.